guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a favorite video of mine that I film a white company dupes. I have a couple of other brands that I'm duping as well within today's video. So I have a load of things in front of me, which I wanna share with you from all of the kind of bargain homeware shops, supermarkets, really accessible places for you to get your hands on cheap alternatives to the high-end brands that we all know and love, like The White Company. So if you are new to my channel and have never come across me before, this is the first video you're stumbling across, firstly, welcome, hello, my name is Freya. I would love it if you would stick around and subscribe. I have been doing these videos for years now. I just love a good bargain dupe find. If you are an existing viewer who is a regular watcher, then a couple of these items you may recognize from vlogs here and there but without further ado I feel like we should all just get comfy relax grab ourselves a hot drink cozy drink maybe even an iced coffee if the sun is shining I've just had a lem sip you may be able to tell from my voice I am a full-blown cold right now so apologies if I just sound a bit nasally it's never a nice sound is it but Oh well. Anyway, let's jump into my first find. This candle plate or this kind of like glass bowl is from Ikea. It's only eight pounds and it's very similar to their glass plate that they did for the hurricane vase. They, no, it's not a vase, it's a hurricane, but they sold them as separates. They sold the base plate so you could just buy this and then put like a big botanical candle in from the white company. I also have recently come across this in Tesco's, part of the Hinch range, and it was actually in the sale. So it does, it's meant to come with like a wooden, like base but there was only one left in our tesco's and it didn't have the wooden base so she actually discounted it for me it's meant to be 16 pounds in the sale for 12 she gave it to me for seven because it didn't have that base and to be honest with you i prefer it without the base anyway so it's very similar but just ribbed on the edging so again like a little fruit bowl or a big candle plate this one's actually got a flat base perfect size for the botanical candles that the white company do. Whilst I was in there, I also spotted this in the sale for five pounds and it is again from the Hinch range and it is a vase, this beautiful kind of cylindrical, how oh, I just made up that word? It's got a rough kind of speckled texture to it. And this is like a glazed top half, very similar to one that they do on the white company, a different shape though, but they do like a glazed top with like a stone base. Thought I would show it to you anyway, because it is in the cell. They had loads of them at our Tesco's and they were only five pounds. So gorgeous vase for a fiver. Whilst I was also in Tesco's, and also before I show you this next item, I also have some fashion dupes from the white company. And again, all from Tesco's, really affordable stuff very much white company style. In fact, I'll show you this as well, this linen shirt that I've got 100% linen from H&M, only 19.99, I've recently picked it up, so I'll leave this linked below, along with as many items as I can find online. But let me show you, let me pull up a price very similar on the white company, what you would expect to pay, 98 pounds, 19.99. Again from Tesco's, I have this mug, very similar to the Bosley range that they do on Neptune, of which I do have one of their mugs and love it. It's probably my favourite mug. They're £8 each, which is pretty reasonable, but these ones are only £3.50 and they look very, very similar. It's just that ribbed design in that shape. And also Asda do one very similar at only £1. So if you can find the Asda one, that's the better dupe. However, if not, Tesco's had loads of these and I just think they're such a good size as well for a big cup of coffee or tea. Next up, I have a home fragrance dupe now and this is from Aldi. We all know Aldi love to dupe the likes of The White Company, Jo Malone. They've also now duped the brand, I never know how to pronounce it, but I think it's like Scandivanesque or something. And it's the Skog candle and rediffuse that they do that they have duped. This one is in Woodland. It's the same color, the same font design, everything. And this is a fraction of the price. I think usually they retail for about 30 pounds. These ones are, I think this one was 199. And then sticking with kind of like candle things, these little tea light holders from Ikea are only three pound 50. And they look just like the ones that the white company do. I feel like a lot of these items that I've got are good for like summer outdoor living, which is very much what the white company do at this time of year. They've got loads of new bits for outdoor living. And these I thought would look perfect on like a nice tablescape outside in the garden. Whilst 
your other half is barbecuing away in the background. Another candle this time from Asda looks very much like the diptyque ones that they do. This one is um, in the, I, th I think it's like a florally kind of scent, botanical blooms. It's called fresh citrus, crisp pear and white florals infused with notes of creamy musk, amber and sweet vanilla orchard. So yeah, orchid. Vanilla orchid, not orchard. This one was only five pounds though, and the diptyque ones usually are anywhere from about 30, 40, 50 pounds. This one is a large outdoor one from B&M, and it's got this beautiful ceramic design that could easily be kind of like reused as a planter after it is burnt. Now this is an outdoor candle only in the citronella scent, 20 hour burn time, eight pound. I love that citronella smell, but obviously, yeah, it's quite strong, so outdoor only. Three wick candle. Now, I wanted to show you this because the White Company have brought out a new range of candles. They are that same ceramic kind of design and three wick bigger candles. They're a little bit deeper though, so better suited for a planter once you have burnt out. They are 120 pounds. So yeah, eight pound alternative from B&M was much more up my street, but if you can see any more in stores for um, the kind of shape a bit more like the White Company one, let me know, because again, they double up amazingly as planters after you've burnt them out. So yeah, that's the next dupe. What shall I show you now? I'll show you this from Asda, because when I spotted this, I loved it, regardless of it being as a dupe or not. I thought this carafe, or jug, I should say, looks beautiful. It's from Asda, it was only nine pounds. I think they do it in like a smoked glass as well, like a darker gray. I just went for the clear. And it reminded me, if you took off the handle, it reminded me of the Morton carafe that they do on the White Company, which I believe is 28 pounds. So very similar. I feel like this, again, outdoor living in summer, some nice sangria. Pims, even just like cucumber and mint and lemon water in there. Sticking with the kind of outdoor living, Home Bargains have these. Now they have these in three different colors. They've got this white, they've got them in like a brown rattan and then a gray as well. I opted for these ones. They are a pack of 10 LED rattan ball string lights for indoor and outdoor use. And they reminded me of the ones that the white company have um, currently, except they just have the white. But yeah, the white company ones are £28. These ones are only £7.99. So, honestly, identical. And they're quite big. I mean, from the image, you can't really tell. But if I show you the actual size of them in the box, they are quite large. So I feel like in a nice outdoor space, they will look beautiful. I'll show you these briefly because I have shown them in like a vlog or a haul. But again, home bargains, these artichoke uh, homeware items are very similar to the Neptune ones. So these standalone ones, which are $3.99, are a bit like the Neptune ones, which are like a end book stand or decorative ornament. They also have tea light holders from Neptune at £18, just really small ones. And then I saw that they also do these in Home Bargains. So it's a set of two, two different heights. You can see there that you've got the option of popping a tea light in or one of the taller candles as well. Really random, but kind of giving Kath Kidson vibes was this bag on checkout at Home Bargains. I'm not gonna keep this, I'm gonna give this to someone because it's not really my style. But if you like Kath Kidson and you like that floral kind of dipsy print, then these are only 179 very much Emma, Emma Bridgewater, not Emma Bridgewater, Kath Kidson. They also have a few new designs of outdoor lanterns on the White Company. One in particular I thought looked very similar to this little find from Home Bargains. This one was only 2 dollars It reminds me of one that the White Company do at £65. So again, fraction of the price and they did that in grey and black. I believe. Whilst we're on the topic of lanterns, they do a seagrass one as well, which I love. It's 50 pounds, it is beautiful. And I saw this one, which kind of reminded me, this one was in the sale as well. It does say seagrass lantern, but it's just a slight different seagrass. But yeah, that's how it looks. It is suitable to pop a candle in. It's just got like a little glass pot at the bottom. And it's from the botanist range, but it was in the clearance from B&M down from eight pounds to just four. So I had to pick that up as well as include it within today's video. So they do quite a lot of rustic linen, whether it be napkins, tablecloths, table runners, and they do a table runner on the White Company for 55 pounds. And I saw this one, 
from Wilco's Table Runner 30 by 180. It is 100% cotton, but it's got that same kind of texture like a rustic linen would have. I think these double up quite nicely as like a runner along your bed. So if you've already got like your bed made, maybe a nice blanket or throw on the end, but then to also run this along the bed. I mean, 180, this would probably fit a double quite nicely. So yeah. I thought that was lovely. And in comparison to the 55 pounds on the white company, this one was just seven pounds. They have this beautiful director's chair on the white company. It's 325 pounds. And when I was looking online, I found one on Dunelm, very, very similar. Still a chunk of money, but more than half the price at £149. I thought they looked very similar, similar kind of style, and I'm almost tempted to get one for this room for when I'm sat filming these videos, because the chair that I'm currently sat on, it's like a foldable garden chair that I might use for, I might just throw it in the back of my car for when I go and watch Tom play cricket to have a chair in the car at all times, and once it's outdoors, I'm not going to probably want to bring it back in here. We are currently sofa shopping as well for our renovations for our downstairs and I've spotted on the white company the Southworld so sofa that I think is gorgeous but it did remind me very much of the one that I got from Ikea. I ended up sending it back because it didn't quite fit the space, it wasn't as comfortable as I thought it was going to be but if you're after a similar alternative then I thought that Ikea one looked very very similar. They have a white bunting I guess for again outdoor dining, any kind of celebrations, outdoor living and it is white with little pom-pom and it is 26 pounds 26 or 28 I can't remember 26 I think um, and I spotted this one in Hobbycraft Hobbycraft had a few actually they did have a white one from Ginger Ray at 10 pounds but they also had their own version of this kind of canvas linen material at five pounds just plain simple um, and then they also had a white one this size but in paper so if you wanted white but even cheaper that one was about three pound three pound fifty so in my utility room i have this storage jar with some steamery balls in they were 25 pounds for four of them and i just really like how they kind of like are on display in the utility room. £25 for the pack, then I spotted these ones in B&M for just £3.50 for three. They're like the exact same size and colour and everything. So if you just kind of want that aesthetic, that look, the jar itself was £2.99 from Home Bargains. Then a couple of bits that I got from Sostren Green, Sostren Green, um, at four, no, £3.88 I got this seagrass trivet. I got this a while ago actually, but I thought I would just mention it again, again with outdoor living coming up. Can't wait to pop this in my kitchen, but it's just a perfect little trivet. I'm almost tempted to get another one of these, just because I feel like if you're cooking, you've got a couple of pans on the go to be able to have these out ready for any hot plates. White Company do one similar for 18 pounds. And then I also spotted these whilst I was in there. Two pound 98 these ones are. They do them in a lighter wood and then this darker acacia wood. I've got a lighter wooded scoop lighter wooden scoop within a glass jar with some bath salts in in my bathroom and then I thought these would be nice in the pantry for like rice flour when I decant things into a nice looking jars to have these out there like uh the white not the white company Zara do in fact I have a couple of Zara ones already but then I spotted these and these ones are cheaper but the Zara ones I think are two for $9.99. Then one other thing I spotted in store that reminded me of the White Company one was a lamp that I spotted in Sainsbury's. I think Sainsbury's homeware are, is so lovely. If you have a big Sainsbury's near you to check out Habitat, highly recommend. But yeah, they've got a bottle lamp in there for £80. And if you reverse the colours of it, it's very similar to the White Company one that they do called the Holbrook table lamp. And that one is £110. Okay, something now that I don't think I've ever done before is feature some clothing dupes that I've spotted in uh, Tesco's. These are all Tesco's finds. So yeah, I had to share them within this video as well. So firstly, this linen jumpsuit, gorgeous, relaxed fit. I got mine in a size medium and it was £27.50. I always think supermarket clothing isn't that cheap when you compare it to the likes of Primark, 
but that one if you compare it to the white company one they customers linen dungarees at 119 pounds they've also got a shorter version for 98 pounds so yeah still a lot more than the 27 pound 50 that tesco's do then i saw this crochet vest top at 15 pounds and it reminded me of one that they do kind of similar is 79 pounds but they also have a crochet dress version so i'm keeping my eyes peeled for a cheaper dress alternative then they have a cotton vintage floral embroidered uh, pair of pajamas for 80 pounds on the white company and i saw this set that tesco's do that i thought looked very similar it's kind of like a frilly top with the kind of embroidered floral design but also the bottoms have the extra added lace along the bottom and they're kind of like a wider leg collot style like a slightly cropped version so perfect for summery months the set of pajamas from tesco's is 29 pounds 50 pence then they've got a beautiful cardigan on the white company for 149 pounds it is cashmere though but this one i thought was a nice alternative very kind of white company style it's quite thin and lightweight so again perfect for the summery months if you just want an extra layer but you want it to be thin and lightweight this one's only 15 pounds I got a medium. Then they also do on the white company a lace insert jersey robe and of course the jersey pajamas. The robe is £60. I have some of the pajama version in that jersey fabric and it's so soft and so comfortable. I think they're about £80 for those pajamas. But again, Tesco's do pajamas in that same fabric and it's super, super soft. So I've shown those before, but I thought I would show that they also do a robe now as well. This one's £19.50. And it's got the lace detail along the sleeve as well as along the bottom. It's kind of like a shorter version. Again, perfect for the warmer months. Imagining just throwing this on in the morning and walking down to our new kitchen, making a coffee with this on. Opening the patio doors, letting the dog out, sun shining in. That's where this robe takes me. And honestly, it's a day that I cannot wait for. We are just around the corner from it, so yes. That is everything that I picked up to share with you within today's dupes video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it, got some inspiration. Do give it a thumbs up if you're a fan of the dupes videos and if you want more of them. If you do want to see more, then I do upload as of when I see something out and about over on my TikTok mainly. Also sometimes on my Instagram homeware account as well. So be sure to follow me over on those platforms if you are on them. Thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you all have a lovely rest of your day and I hope to see you all very, very soon in my next video. Bye guys.